So just finished work. Thought I would show my pre-workout meal for the day. I got some beef, pasta, and veggies, and a Caesar salad. No idea if my face is dirty. Clean it the best I can. But uh, this is the first time I'm gonna do a 10 by 10 since I was 15, 16. I never completed the 10 sets of 10 at that time. At that time, I was trying to do 10 sets of 15 with like a 70% of my one or max, but not smart. But uh, yeah, first time doing 10 sets of 10, uh, and I'm gonna see what it's like. So I'm just gonna do a plate and uh, go from there. Okay, so here's my first set. I ended up getting 10 reps. I really can't believe that I contemplated using 155 pounds instead of 135. Uh, I had a friend that told me to use 35s, but I just I just wanted to push myself. On top of that, I've never used a thumbless bench press before, so this was the first time I'm actually trying it, and honestly, I got more confident as I kept going. So I recorded sets one, five, eight, and 10. Now this is the fifth set right here. This was absolutely brutal. Like I was honestly feeling it. It was getting harder to push at seven and eight. And uh, yeah, my sixth set, I ended up only hitting nine. Seventh only hitting seven. And looking at this, I'm really having trouble keeping my shoulders back and I have no idea why my legs are so small. I really gotta work on those things. Eighth set, I only got eight. I gotta say this, this was pretty brutal. I'm glad I don't put clips on. I'm trying to bench without them. And I honestly thought at one point I'm gonna have to dip the bar sometime in maybe set nine or 10. It, it is a brutal workout. Only giving myself a minute and a half rest in between each one. Maximum two minutes. Set 10, call me crazy in set nine, I only hit seven. Set 10, guess what I got? This was one of the easiest ones for me. This guy that was recording me was really motivating me. I don't understand why. What made this so easy is because I was honestly just more confident, not just because the guy was motivating me a little bit, it was really just because out of all the other reps I was doing in sets, I really just figured out a little bit of a groove and was more confident in trying out this new grip as well. You won't believe it, but I tried to attempt 10 sets of 10 for rope extensions. And I gotta tell you, I could only make it to five because at five, I really had to use the bathroom. I came back, tried to set. I was just so depleted and dead, but really just trying to feel my muscles here because I haven't trained arms properly in the last two to three weeks. This felt really good. So I just finished my workout right now. And um, basically the, the reason why I did this today was I, uh, I attempted a workout earlier today and uh, I went for a one rep max on my bench press. So my progression uh, sets were uh, basically for the workout was one really heavy set, which was going to be my one rep max today. And uh, then I would do 20 pounds less on bench and do uh, as many reps as I can. So it was about two reps and then uh, for two sets. And then I would drop it down 40 pounds and then rep it out as much as I can uh, with a controlled negative about two seconds. Um, so this workout that I did today was to try something new. Uh, to shock my muscles because I don't really train uh, anymore with compound movements, lighter weight, higher reps. So it's something good to try out. Now this is not something that you can do like every week um, as like a progression thing. Um, and this is not a uh, solution to any kind of plateau. Uh, it's just to straight up um, just shock the muscle and try something new, give it a, give it more time to rest. Cause I went in, um, doing the one rep max and I failed and then I went down to 245 which I've never failed since uh last October I believe it was and I ended up getting that only halfway and came down so felt really weak today felt really tired didn't have a lot of food um going into that workout so there was also just not a lot of things going my way so because I felt really weak I'm not going to go back in attempt to do this workout again and uh then just go heavy weight so that was kind of my thought process now I am going to be posting all my workouts um, that I've been doing now in upper lower upper lower split and a fifth day for arms um, just editing my my plan and figure out what's going to work and what's not um, I've never done a five by five um, workout before and that's what I'm going to be doing for bench press because uh, I've been plateauing for a little bit body weight's been staying staying the same a little bit um, basically for the past three months mainly because of school and work uh, not a lot of time to Eat, eat as many meals as I used to um, so I do what I can and I've progressed in uh, my deadlift um, squat I just started doing up again uh, no pain in my hip 
which I used to have a big pinch in before where I couldn't squat down. So a lot of uh, pluses. Um, upper body went up to uh, 110, dum 10, 110 pound dumbbells up in uh, my bench press. And uh, I ended up getting three sets of one, got a little weaker. I only got for one set of one, exact same thing, not enough food, very tired, um, but just doing what I can. So time to switch it up. I'm um, getting a little lighter, going five sets of five, trying it out and uh, just pushing through and seeing if I can progress there. So thank you for watching this video. If you definitely want to try out this workout, I, I totally recommend it once in a while. Um, I, I probably consider it on like a, uh, a deload week if you're if you're doing heavier lifting. Uh, basically, my my goals are to be more in like powerlifting um, to build my strength because basically my whole life I've been weak. I started off curling eight pound dumbbells uh, for like three, four on each arm. Um, for years of working out, my max bench was 215, uh, 325 deadlift and uh, two plate squat for four reps. So I've always been relatively like weak. Um, not to say like those are weak, um, you know, it's just not the, not no numbers that turn heads and still not. Um, but I'm doing this for myself and not for anyone else. And um, honestly, I just enjoy lifting heavier and I do all my strength training in the beginning and then do my hypertrophy stuff all at the end uh, for higher reps and lighter weight and I enjoy it too. Just putting your headphones, listening to music and jamming out but really focusing on contracting the muscle. I'm gonna make more videos on those kinds of things and, and really explain what my workouts are for. Why do I do each exercise? Because every single exercise I program in my own workouts, it's all for purpose, it's all for reasons, not just to sh throw something in there to show off or um, to have like a trendy workout or anything like that. Everything's for a reason. And if something isn't working in the long term, then just switch it up and that's that's where the editing of your program comes in. So I thank you for watching this video and look forward to uh, seeing your thoughts and comments um, and other videos as well that uh, I hope to, uh, Lord willing, upload. Everyone have a nice day and thank you again.